to another video. Yo, it's been a minute since we have made a video together. It's been way too long. Do you long. remember this one? <laughs> it's me. Dude, it's her. It's my roommate. It's it, my soul sister. It's my business partner. It's my best friend. <laughs> I love you so much. We are coming at you today with lots of pumpkin goodies because tis the fucking season. Tis the motherfucking season. The best season. Actually, I really like the holidays, but yeah. I love I love me some pumpkin goods. Yeah. And honestly, we haven't been able to do a taste test together in a while because this one was prepping all year through COVID. Like what? For the longest For the time. Longest. But yo, we have bags on bags. Bag yes. Stuff. And let me tell you, these have been sitting on the kitchen counter since yeah. this weekend. And I just look at all of it and I'm like, I'm savage. Game, Game on. It's time. So it is time. So we're just gonna go through everything here. Most of the stuff is from Trader Joe's. We'll let you know if there's anything else. Um, but yeah, you wanna just you wanna just get started? Yeah. Okay. So whatever you think. Yes. This is maple flavored with other natural flavors. Maple and sea salt. Yeah. Wait, okay, so I know this one's not pumpkin, but like maple is fall, you know. Yeah, I saw it. It was cute. It's a fall exclusive. Yeah. Gluten free. Yes. So your girl can have it. Yes. I feel like you're probably a much neater bag here. Probably. You know, some people like, I'm just like a messy, like, just get it open. And some people <laughs> that like drive some face. Enneagram, Enneagram one. Oh, that hurts my Enneagram oh. one. But it's okay. okay. Okay, some bullshit. First of all, bag half full. What? Joe. Excuse me. I'm trying to be a festive Oh, bitch. it smells really good though. I will give it that. Mm. Okay. I know you're a little bit congested, but <laughs> I don't have COVID, guys. I she don't. does not have COVID. I had okay. the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Cheers. 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 Oh, it smells so good. Mm-hmm. Holy fuck, dude. I will say, it's really good. Like, kettle corn, uh -huh. if you guys watch my channel, you know it's my shit. Like, after my show, I just wanted, I, I brought a big, big ass bag of kettle corn. I don't taste much like meat. I got just a hint of it, but it is mainly kettle corn. Yeah. Which I Which love. is so freaking good. Yes. Yes. So, okay, what we'll do at the end of this video is rank everything. Yeah. So, make sure you watch. Until I'm not going to lie to you. I already tried these. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one thing I could not hold myself back. Um, pumpkin spice pretzel slims. Okay, any pretzel, any slim is my thing. Okay. This, these are like dipped in chocolate, but it's pumpkin spice flavor. There's... Um, there's like chunks. Oh yeah, crushed pumpkin spiced pumpkin seeds, bro. Hey, no. hello. Oh, there, there we. Okay. You know, what? we're just gonna eat it. Well, um, I'm like, do I get gluten? Yeah. Do you want like a little? I'll have a, a little guy. Okay. And there's, I'm gonna get hate for this, guy. but oh, I'll take, I'll take, the take the smaller guy. I'll take this guy. Okay. Okay. I know I'm gonna get hate for this, yeah, but show the, uh, white yogurt covered pretzels are like my favorite. They have really good gluten free ones, but. Look at that texture. All right. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> I like I like it because they're the thin, so there's not as much pretzel, so you just get like a lot of white chocolate. A lot of white chocolate and a lot of pumpkin. Mm-hmm. Those are mother freaking bomb. I will be surprised if anything beats these. Yep. Okay. Next, do we do the bog lays? Yeah, we can I feel like it. we can just talk about it. Oh, these. yeah. We don't need to eat a bagel. <laughs> but obviously, Lex has the GF version. Yeah. What is your. Okay, you, you describe the GF ones. The GF ones, I would say they're very, like, doughy. Mm. You've had the GF mm. ones. So they're very, like, doughy and, like, squishy and soft, like, more so than the Trader Joe's, like, regular bagels. Um, and they're very. They're not, like, super sweet or anything, but they're very pumpkin. I literally, before pumpkin season is over, will probably buy eight bags. These yes. are like the only bagels I cray. I cray. I cray. You cray cray! These are the only bagels. <laughs> bagels that make me cray cray. Okay? Okay, oh. cray. Okay, cray. Um, yeah, those are good. Let me feel. Yeah, they're just a lot softer. These guys are like, I'm not going to lie. They're not my favorite. Like, they're just dense and like hard. 
And they're not pre-sliced, which is oh, that's some bullshit. a little frustrating. I just prefer everything bagels that are, they're just thicker and softer. Like, love that these are pumpkin, but there's really nothing super special about them, yeah. unfortunately. You'll have to do the DF and see if you yeah. prefer. Yeah, but going along with those, we have the uh, mm. pumpkin cream cheese. Fuck me up. This, hello. <laughs> this is what we live for all freaking year. And honestly, I thought we were gonna try this, but we've already eaten it, so. Yeah, we, I literally wait all year for it. I will say, usually I'm like a, like if I buy whipped cream, whipped cream, <laughs> cream cheese, I'll buy like the whipped one. Yeah. But that one, it's like very soft. You know, like sometimes yeah. if you buy regular cream cheese, it's like just hard to spread, which is why I started getting the whipped one. Uh -huh. That one's not. It's like super soft, mm -hmm. super like pumpkin spice sweet. I don't know. Yeah. Like it's honestly a little, um, like when you say pumpkin spice, like it's like spicy kind yeah. of. And yeah, it's it's definitely spreadable. I'm just, I'm so used to using the whipped that I'm like a brat. I'm like, why is this one not whipped? But when you compare it to like a brick of cream cheese, like this is a lot easier. Yeah. So it's really good. Definitely get this. It's really good on like rice cakes, <sighs> toast. On a spoon. I put it in, um, <laughs> try this, cream of rice or oats. You And then oh, you yeah. put peanut butter and then you put the cream cheese. Fuck me up, fuck me up. Or like, if you aren't GF, you could do like cookie butter and then oh the God. pumpkin oh, cream cheese. I'm doing it tonight, I'm do I am doing that tonight. That sounds so, so good. so good. On a chocolate or caramel rice cake? Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. Next up, I guess, the pumpkin flavored JoJo. Listen, I don't know why, but these were the first thing that came to my mind uh, when I thought of pumpkin stuff from Trader Joe's. So, if you're not familiar with Trader Joe's, JoJo's are basically like Oreos. Yeah. But they're Joe's version. And of course, I had to get the pumpkin flavored. So, we shall see. I feel like most stuff from Trader Joe's is pretty freaking dank. So, I'm going to be sad if these aren't that great. But, you know. It's pumpkin and it's Trader Jose. Yes. That's going to not be good. We shall see. Am I trying this solo? I'll try like a bite of one. You know, should we just. Lex is being bad. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'll take the lid off. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. It's orange. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, go. cheers. Cheers. Hmm. It tastes like tea. It's like too artificially. It's like the cookies don't have much flavor. And then the inside's like, it's very like, not sweet pumpkin it's like that like cinnamon i would say yeah yeah man they're not bad like i'm gonna eat them well, but they're not my favorite honestly those jank i had these <laughs> like store brand pumpkin spice wafers from um ralph's and they were honestly amazing the ralph's store brand shit is actually really yeah. good they have gluten-free animal crackers that i used <sighs> to be addicted to yes so get those if you uh see them but Okay, all right, Onward. <laughs> onwards. Next up, we're gonna do pumpkin O's. Pumpkin O's. The um, pumpkin Cheerios are bomb. I will say, usually I don't like yeah, the are. like Jozo's because they're like really hard. Yeah, they are. But we'll see about these. Jozo's are like Cheerios. Yeah. Oh, these are like kind of big. Yeah. No, these are GF. Are they? Yeah. Oh yeah. Cheerios are gluten free. Low fat, vegan, gluten free. We love that. Okay, I'm gonna grab a couple of these guys. Does anybody smell like anything? They don't really taste like anything. They taste like these. Again, I don't know if it's like artificially. It'll be a good snack. Yeah. No, I would I think don't. that I like to just have something to stick my hand in. Yeah. After I eat. <laughs> yeah. You're like, Zero calories. Yeah. They're not bad, but you definitely want to, I don't know, like add them as like a topping. But yeah, I was going to say, I wouldn't eat like a whole bowl of them. You yeah, know. Probably because I, I don't I just like, no. But no. they would be good as like a topping on like protein brownie batter or something. <sighs> we might, we might fuck around with that. I was going to say I might fuck around with that. Um, This one we will not be tasting, but we got GF. Pumpkin bread and muffin baking mix because you know we're bakers. Well, we're we're gonna bake when we get back. From we're gonna bake. Good old Chad Yeah, this weekend we're going to Chicago, 
If you watched my last video, you already know that. <laughs> um, so yeah, maybe we'll make some muffins or... We should make chocolate chip pumpkin. Uh, there will be choc chips put in these. Uh-huh. That's what's going to happen. Uh, let's do this guy. Talk about this guy. Oh. Well, so this we were uh, sent. It is a pumpkin spice protein brownie. The brand is Eat Me Guilt Free. So it's kind of like... It's kind of like the same macros as a protein bar. It's 170 calories, 8 carbs, 5, uh, five fat, I think it was like 20, 22 protein. Oh, damn, he's packing a punch. He's packing a punch. <laughs> so, I feel like I haven't tried this yet. I haven't tried anything from this brand, so I'm like, it could either be really good or really we bad. We gonna see. But, um, do you want to weekend? Yep, I don't, I don't need 22 grams of protein from, okay. It smells good. Cheers, Kim. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. Don't. Just don't. Just don't. Um, what I will say is we are very privileged to have a neighbor who is a great baker. Yes. And the protein <laughs> bullshit is not going to yeah. cut it. He makes shit from scratch, y'all. Every yeah. single thing you could possibly imagine, and we have been. Yep blessed yep um but it's honestly just like very uh like dry it's it's dry and i'm not really sure what the ingredients are yep sorry uh, okay <laughs> moving right along we have pumpkin spice batons because you know Ooh, you want the cookies with the delicate shaker? yeah delicate rolled wafers filled with pumpkin spice okay Yo, the macros honestly aren't that bad either. The serving size is two pieces. So for two, it's six fat, 15 carb, and one protein. Well, that's not bad. Um, opening this might be a... He punches me in the face, <laughs> ripping off the fucking... <laughs> Look, so but those, it's like suctioned. <clears throat> I don't know why I like, want to use my teeth. Here we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. <clears throat> you need a little like, pirouette. Brand cookies or whatever. Mm -hmm. My grandma eats them. My diabetic grandmother eats them all the time. Those were my jam when I was They're kid. so good. I'm probably gonna end up breaking them. Should I get scissors? Mm. Oh, wait. There might be a little guy. Oh, there we go. They were like, this Melinda is, is gonna try to open this and we need to make it. We need to make this. this okay. Okay. You wanna break? You wanna break? Yeah. I'm like, uh, they actually are equal. <laughs> I can't take the smaller one. Okay. So it looks like we have the, uh, I'm not even going to try it. Looks like we have some filling in here. So yeah. cheers, buddy. Cheers. It doesn't taste like much. I, I like the cookie. I like the wafer. It's not super sweet, mm -hmm. but then the inside, the frosting's sweet. It's good. Yeah, I like that. I don't really have any complaints there. No. Very simple. Like, I wouldn't go out of my way. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I wouldn't, like, eat it again. Or buy it again, but... <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't eat it again, but... She wouldn't buy it again. <laughs> meant buy it. But we'll eat. Yes. Okay. Oh. <laughs> These are basically pumpkin uh, Pop-Tarts. I don't know. I still had a Pop-Tart. Um, organic. Hey. Hey. <laughs> that means it's healthy, right? Yep. It does. We're unfortunately going to waste quite a bit of one of these because I know we're not about to get a whole one, but... Well, okay. you can save it. Yeah. Put a little bit of Break it, it on up. top of protein granny bed. Yeah. Okay. We have all the toppings, y'all. See what he looks like. Oh, he's really pretty. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, yeah. Get in there, sis. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers. I like it. But it could be because I'm used to the GF life, and I'm like, no. wow, gluten. Yeah. That is good. I like it. I do like it. That'd be good um, topping. Topper. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like that they're pretty generous on the filling. Yes. Yes, there was quite a bit in the middle. Okay. A couple more things. Oh, Petite. those are going to be so good. Pumpkin spice cookies. Shortbread cookies with pumpkin spice and yogurt coating. Yo, I just, looking at these kind of cookies, I know. I know that they're gonna be freaking bomb. Dude, it's like the, anything that are like the frosting covered, like animal crackers, those are when I was a kid. Yo. In college, I used to buy like the big clear the, container. Yep. <laughs> yep. It's like a handful. My nutrition in college was 
You know, I wonder why I looked the way I did. Yeah. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Yo, these are holiday as fuck. Well, they're like, so... I feel cozy. Those are very freaking good. Do you want my half? Thank you, though. Those are really good. Okay, those really are gonna be near the top, good. I'll tell you that. Okay, the only other thing that we have oh. is pumpkin butter, which we've both eaten before. It's so good. So, thoughts on this. Um, fun fact, I know we haven't said the macros for everything, but I actually used to track this last year. One tablespoon, 18 grams, is 10 grams of carbs. That's it, so. It's like jelly, basically, yeah. but pumpkin. Like pumpkin jelly. Yes, 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 yes. So, uh, thoughts on this guy? It's really freaking good. Like, mm -hmm. um, it's good with like the pumpkin cream cream cheese. I used to put it on like toaster waffles or toast. Yes. Or on a bagel. It's freaking bomb. You can also do it with like peanut butter. Um, it's good. It's good. If you need yeah. some quick carbs. Yeah. Yeah, it is good. Um, I would say definitely pick it up. Last yeah. year I stockpiled it. Yeah, very good. So, I think that's Shall everything. We rank? Yeah, so let's pick out, what's your favorite? Um, I mean, because I am limited on like what I that's can true. eat. I would say, for me, it was probably the, yeah. And I was like a snacker. Yeah. So this is like. My favorite is for sure these guys. Those are really I good. I love chocolate covered pretzels. I can smell them. So okay. much. And when you put some pumpkin spice on those bitches, like, game oh. over. But my second place. Those are really freaking good. Is definitely these. I'm just like, I'm a dipped, like a covered mm -hmm. white chocolate. This this is yogurt, actually. But whatever. If it's coated, mm -hmm. if it's dipped, I'm here for it. So yep. these are my top faves. The kettle corn was also very good. Um, everything else is like good, right, or neutral. Things I would not. Don't, not this. Yeah, not that. Not this. Um, what was the other thing that I was like, this is just subpar. I feel like the Joseph's. Oh, yeah. the bagels. Yeah, this, and the, the bagels, it's so sad. It's so sad because I wanted, I wanted more. It's okay, we can have the GF ones. Yeah, but the GF ones are good. So I think the GF ones are just like, feel how hard those are. Yeah, this is like hard. This is like, like, yeah. Gloopy. And they're sliced. And they're sliced. Yeah. But yeah, these are really good. So yeah, otherwise, everything else, pretty dang good. Those are not bad. Pumpkin O's, get your pumpkin butter, get your pumpkin cream cheese, mm -hmm. for sure. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> those, those are the, the move. We oh started off on a banger. Oh, it smells so good. And this, you like, don't need to feel bad about stacking up. No. Because one and a half cups, 21 carbs and seven fat. Yeah. Which is a lot. lot. <laughs> yeah. So there is this year's pumpkin taste test because we couldn't do it last year because my bitch ass was on prep. Oh, yeah. That was sad time. Dude, holiday taste test? Oh, we're Oh, I think we did that last year, but but we're doing it round two. We're doing it round two. So um, let us know what videos you want to see from us because we like filming together. We just yeah. haven't done it in so long. Yeah. Um, life's been crazy, but I always have time for you. <laughs> so hopefully, I literally miss these so freaking much. Dude, me too. So again, let us know what you want to see. And yeah, there you have it. So, oh, if you also have other Trader Joe's or pumpkin recommendations, drop them in the comments below. If you want to see us try stuff, let us know. But otherwise, as always, if you watched until now, I'm taking all my good vibes. I'm sending them your way. If you could give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that bell before you leave, that would be dope. And we will catch you in the next one. Peace. Bye. Oh.